What's up everybody? Hope you're doing super well today. I'm sitting here in one of my closings this week. We closed on this Wednesday while I was in Miami. This is Turquoise Place 24, 2104D. I represented the buyer and the seller, 1.185, super blessed. Let me show you guys the view. And if you came to Miami, um, thank you so much for your support. You guys were amazing. If you watched on the live stream, thank you so much. Um, if you didn't see it, I'm gonna put a link in this video for you to watch the replay. Um, every balcony has a jacuzzi. Look at the size of this balcony. And look at the view. Looking straight to Perdido Pass. Every balcony has a built-in gas grill. And you got a view down the beach the other way. These units are absolutely breathtaking. So, I know my client is really happy. And that's what makes me happy. It's a three bedroom, three bath, about 2,400 square foot. And uh, these things are, are quite amazing. <laughs> but what I wanted to share with you guys today is, uh, is how I do this, right? You do this by building relationships with your clients. You know, when I showed this buyer, which by the way was a referral from an agent in Louisiana, I didn't walk into this expecting a deal to happen. I walked into this trying to help this person look at these condos, decide if it's something that she really wants to do, and then help her do it if she decided to take that next step. I'm not expecting anything from anyone. I just want to help them do whatever it is they're trying to do. If they're trying to research, let me help you research. I'm not trying to figure out how to close every single client. I'm actually just trying to figure out what I can do to help them through the process and get to the other side. If they don't decide to move forward, that's okay. I wasn't expecting anything. How did I close seven deals the day I was in Miami? It's easy. It's called preparation. The day before the event, I went through all the closing documents of all seven deals, talked to all the clients. They knew I wasn't going to be there. Only one of them was going to be present at closing. The rest were, were closing remotely. Um, so that makes things a lot easier. And that's one, that's one of the benefits of the last year. You know, a lot of closings are happening remotely now. So, you know, it, 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 they, they, people really overlook, they give you the benefit of the doubt. Okay. Um, when you have such a strong relationship with them, they know you're looking out for their best interest. They always are okay with you, um, you know, being out of town that day, if need be. A lot of agents say, well, you're a single agent. How are you going to go on vacation? Simple. I'm going to prepare beforehand, let my clients know what's up. They're going to be happy that I go on vacation. Um, they're going to be thrilled. They know how hard I work. Everybody loves a hard worker, and they're always going to work with you guys. People love you. Stop thinking that people don't want to work with you. Stop thinking that people don't like you or don't love you. They do. Start acting like it. Talk to your clients like they're family, and they're going to start treating you like family. Start treating them like family, they're going to look at you like family. It's really that simple, guys. So uh, I'm going to put a link below for the, the replay of the Miami speech. Best speech to date. Um, I know you guys, if you haven't seen it, you're going to get a lot out of it. It was very life-changing for me even. Just to get up there and, and uh, give that presentation for me was life-changing. So thank you guys so much. All the love. Um, please message me on Instagram if you have any questions or anything I can do for you. I just got called up today from all the messages uh, this week. And um, all the love you guys are sharing me there. So thank you so much for that. And if there's anything I could do for you, please reach out. We'll see you guys on the next video. Keep crushing it. Keep pushing. I know you can do it, guys. Talk to you soon.